Out of the 12 fruit trees that I planted last year, two pear trees didn't make it. Now, Chief River Nursery has a fantastic warranty program, and they sent me two new ones completely free, just simply because the other two didn't make it last year. I can't recommend them enough. Chief River Nursery. Now, here we are sprinkling a little bit of, yep, not fertilizer, that's mom and dad. Yep, mom and dad go on every fruit tree that I've planted so far, and they will continue to go on every fruit tree that I plant in the future, but I don't really plan to plant anymore. <laughs> Maybe two more? I don't, I'm running out of space here. But either way you look at it, oh, I'm really hoping that these pear trees make it. They seem like they will. I mean, they have a great root stock. They've got a, a nice thick trunk going already. I mean, they're just little itty bitty fruit trees. They're still going to take like five years, but either way you look at it, I mean, they're, they're getting there one step at a time, right? Put my little cages on them here. Yeah, buddy. Got to protect them from the deer and the rabbits and the whatever hell else wants to eat them. Tack them down here with my tent spikes. Yeah, I learned that mistake. Some windy days I had to fetch these fucking things out of the neighbor's yards. Jesus. <laughs> these are helping a lot better. These tent spikes, you know, they're like seven inches long and they really hold these fuckers down. So, and here's my orchard. Yeah, we got two uh, pear trees over here, and then we've got the two pear trees that we just planted that are a different variety. And then we've got uh, two plum trees, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. And then we've got the apricot grove over here with the last three apricot trees. Yeah, buddy. My, uh, I've got apple trees in another place. I've got cherry trees in another place. But back here, this is looking good, and this is my backyard orchard, my friends. I hope it keeps growing.